Welcome to a new fragrance review. Today I'm going to tell you what I think to be the best fragrance of all time. So, the best fragrance of all time is not my favorite fragrance. I wouldn't even put it in my top 5, though definitely it will be in my top 10. And it's Polo by Ralph Lauren, the green bottle with the gold cap. And why I say it's the best fragrance of all time? There's many reasons of that. First of all, when it was created it was in a time where perfumery really started to explode, especially for men. And there was a lot of new things going on with perfumery, new ingredient. And I feel in that specific time, it was easier to access a lot of different things in perfumery than it was earlier before. I would say now it's even easier to get multiple different ingredients. But still, at that time was a great time to make something amazing. And that's what they did. The fragrance itself was a really amazing fragrance at the time. It was not born when it was made, but I heard everyone was wearing it. And if not everyone was wearing it, it was definitely the fragrance that started the 80s fragrance. Every fragrance with oak moss, maybe a little bit of aldehyde, with also some pine and tobacco, some leather into it. All those fragrances really typical of the 80s. It's Polo by Ralph Lauren that started it all. It's then that started more powerhouse fragrance and really started the whole train of fragrance as we know it now. And still, being an old fragrance, it's still on the market. I don't believe it will disappear. It was recently, a couple of years ago, reformulated to look more like the original because it changed a little bit too much from what I heard. Current version is really similar to the original. It's as close as it can be with modern ingredients. And even without considering all those facts that it really changed the world of perfumery and for many other brands started the idea of making a fragrance for men. Another thing with this fragrance is that people enjoy it. As I said, it's still on the market because people buy it, but it's not just people that used to wear it. One famous person that wears this fragrance is 50 Cent, the rapper. And another famous person will be Warren Buffett that probably was wearing it from the time, but 50 Cent is young enough to be able to wear anything else. Both of them are rich, so they could wear something else. And if they wear it, it's because they like it, especially considering 50 Cent has its own fragrance line. Though most people with a fragrance line don't wear their own fragrance, just how it is. But even so, the fragrance, when I bring it and when I wear it, if I make it smell to other people, I never had anyone say it doesn't smell good. They might not like it for themselves, but I always enjoy it. Even I know someone that's a big fan of Polo, I have a lot of Polo fragrance, and actually was not such a big fan because he never smelled it before, but I made it smell it and he really loved it. It's one of my most complimented fragrance. It's just a fragrance that people still love. And what's weird about it, it has everything needed to be dated. You can wear other 80s fragrance and you won't have that kind of reaction. People will say it's not everyone, but people will say that it's dated, that it doesn't smell like an old grandpa or anything. It has everything it needs to fit in that category, but still people enjoy it. People love it. So that's why I think it's actually more objectively the best fragrance of all time for men. If you haven't smelled it differently, you should give it a try and maybe avoid bottle that will be either right with gray cap. It's not good. Polo by Ralph Lauren. Best fragrance of all time. So, hope you enjoyed the video. If it's the case, like and share if you have a different idea of what is the best fragrance of all time. And don't take your personal consideration. Go really with what you think objectively is the best fragrance of all time. Put it in the comment. So, thanks for watching. And see you soon. Thank you.